This time we will learn how to solve stratified random sampling. Please don't forget to subscribe my channel. Stratified random sampling. What is stratified random sampling? Like for example, you're going to conduct a study in the municipalities, different municipalities of Bohol. And in every municipalities, there are different barangays. And in every barangay, there are different number of population. So you are going to find how many respondents from each barangay. So you are going to apply stratified sampling. Stratified sampling is generally applied in order to obtain a representative sample. The population is divided into several subpopulations that are individually more homogeneous than the population. The different subpopulations are called strata. Then we select items from each stratum to constitute a sample. So how to form a strata and how should items be selected from each stratum? So for example, you have a total population of 5,000. For example, in a university, you have a total population of 5,000 and you are using the standard 5% margin of error. So we have different department for every, for the university. So we have here four departments, College of Education, College of Compute, Engineering and Computer Studies, College of Arts and Sciences, College of Business and Administration. So a total of 5,000. So in each department, there are different population. For the College of Education, we have 900. For the College of Engineering and Computer Studies, you have 2,000. From the College of Arts and Sciences, you have 1,000. From the CBA, you have 1,100. Again, a total of 5,000. So how many total sample out of this population? So first, you are going to find first the total sample. So you are going to apply the Slovens, Slovens formula. So we have the formula N over uh, 1 plus the population times the margin of error squared. So substitute 5,000 divided by 1 plus 5,000 times the 0 0.05 squared. So you have a total sample of 370. So after you get the total, you're going to get now the sample for each department. So what is the formula? You have their population for each department multiplied by the total population, total sample rather, divided by the total population. So for College of Education, you have 900 times 370 divided by 5,000. That is 67. There are 67 respondents from the College of Education. For the College of Engineering and Computer Studies, you have 2,000 population times the total sample 370 divided by the total population of 5,000. We have 148. For the College of Arts and Sciences, 1,000 times 370 divided by 5,000 is equal to 74. For the CBA, you have 1,100 times 370 divided by 5,000 is equal to 81. So we have there a sample for each department from the College of Education 67, from the COEX 148, from the CAS 74, from the CBA you have 81. So you are going to round off to whole number since sample or the students is a discrete whole number, discrete, you cannot subdivide. So you have a total sample of 370. So out of 370, you have a different sample for each department. So this is how you're going to solve using stratified sampling. Comment there, and I hope you can apply this one. We hope that you found this video helpful. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more videos on research.